hands shielding his eyes from the fierce sun. Extreme heat and exercise proving too much for this golfer at Richmond. Taken to hospital by paramedics as Sydney entered its second day of a heat wave. We've already had a higher number than usual drop already in, in, from heat exhaustion. As temperatures soared, a summer haze settled over Sydney in spring. It peaked early in the city, 34 degrees at 10am. Our hottest suburbs, Penrith and Richmond, reaching 41 just after 2 o'clock. Sydney sweltering. The usual average this time of year is 24 degrees. For those outside today, the beach was the obvious choice. This was Bondi. It's trying to stay in the shade, if possible. I work up in Darwin. This is pleasant. This is nothing. So we're all soft in Sydney, do you reckon? Yeah, you are. National volleyball officials at Manly were keeping a close eye on the thermometer. Temperatures on the court can be five degrees hotter than off. It's not just the sun, it's the reflection from the sand. But at least they had a coastal breeze. The meat wasn't the only thing sizzling at this Penrith kebab shop. Inside is two, three degrees at least more. It's really, very hot. While at the dry cleaners in St Mary's, steam was literally coming out of workers' ears. It wouldn't be unusual for us um, in this environment if it's 40 degrees outside to find that it's you know, 45, 50 degrees. And the advice from the Bureau is to keep those air conditioners switched on. Laura Tunstall, Nine News.